على الآيات والذكر وفي فيض من العطر هنا رمضان ما درسة تنير مآثر الفكر السلام عليكم Welcome to Ramadan Eats with Shaz Eats This week I'm going to be showing you how to make a Moroccan harira soup and I've been to Saudi Arabia, to Mecca and Medina and often at the buffet tables um, in the hotels. The, for the starter, there's a wonderful uh, array of different breads and alongside it, there's always a big pot of Moroccan Herrera soup. Now, a Moroccan Herrera soup is a soup with chickpeas and brown lentils and it cooks down with lots of Moroccan spices and a um, in a beef broth for over a long time in which it just absorbs um, the nutrients from the vegetables and the pulses. Now in this recipe, the normal any sort of soup recipe really starts down by chopped carrots and celery and some onions and that's sauteed down and everything else then just gets added in and then you just forget about it for a few hours and it all comes together um, for a lovely hearty whole food fulfilling iftari meal to start off. So I'm going to take all of these things onto the other side and show you how to put this all together. I'm going to start off with a good gludge of olive oil into my pan and then to the pan I'm going to add in my white onion. And just soften this down. Okay, just stir it around. I'm now just going to add in my carrots and my chopped celery. Now these three ingredients are usually the main components of a soup or a broth or a stew and they give a lot of flavor and depth to any recipe. Now to the onions and the carrots and the celery, I'm going to add in some Moroccan um, spice. Now the Moroccan spice is quite readily available in most supermarkets in South Africa and it's a blend of cumin and paprika, smoked paprika, and lots of um, other herbs and spices like thyme and coriander um, and they have a lovely blend to it so rather than reinventing the wheel it's an easier way just to get a ready-made blend and you just add it into the base of the onions the celery and the carrots to so move it around until the aroma starts coming through There's a real lovely whiff that comes out. And to that, I'm going to now add some chopped garlic. Now at this stage, you could actually even add in beef cubes or lamb cubes to this soup, but I'm actually not going to because I think the chickpeas and lentils are already meaty enough, but if your family does like the extra texture of actual meat, then um, you can add some beef or lamb in. So instead, I'm gonna now firstly add in my tomatoes. I'm now going to add in my chickpeas. I'm going to add in my brown lentils. Mix that all up. And this gets topped up with some really good beef stock. And you basically just forget about this for around 20 minutes. 
or even longer. Um, the longer it cooks, the more flavor flavorful it becomes. And then in the end, I'm just going to stir in some spinach leaves that wilt down quite immediately into the soup. And it's a nice chunky lentil chickpea harira soup that gets created. Just a bit of seasoning of some salt and some pepper. I'm going to put the lid completely over and reduce the heat for it just to cook down. The Moroccan Harira soup has been cooking for quite a while. All I'm going to do now is add in some baby spinach into the soup and that just adds in extra fiber, extra goodness for this holy month. It wilts down quite easily and buffs up the soup quite well and just gives it another dimension as well of flavor and texture into the soup. This Moroccan Harira soup, a real traditional soup that can be readily found in the Middle East. Um, when I have it, it really does remind me of my days in Mecca and Medina, having a soup with the hajis and people from Umrah and um, enjoying that to a start of a meal. It's got no meat in it. Um, it's just chickpeas and brown lentils, but it's really hearty and it does feel it's meaty enough. Um, really nutritious as well and good for you. I think this would be a real family pleaser, quite easy to make up. So if you haven't got something ready, a last minute thing, um, easy to whip up in your kitchen. I think your family will enjoy it. Give it a go. Ramadan Eats with Shazis. Enjoy. وفي فيض من العطر هنا رمضان مدرسة تنير مآثر الفكر على الآيات والذكر وفي فيض من العطر هنا رمضان مدرسة تنير مآثر الفكر